Welcome back, Stalkers. So, we're gonna start this part a little bit different than the last parts. Hello! So, I actually know what I'm gonna do because I played for an hour and a half and my recording got busted because of the, the Windows 10 updates and my recording was not centered. So, yeah, I'm dead. Some pretty insane stuff happened and I wish I could show you but I can't. Now what I can do is redo it but it's not going to be as exciting as it was the first time around because that, that was really crazy. I got stuck in a mission, I had to chuck all of my stuff down so I could run for cover and I got lost. I went into some kind of uh, sewer complex and I found all sorts of goodies so we're going to try to to repeat that I don't know how it's gonna turn out and I don't know if I'm gonna be successful as I was the first time around because it's not an easy thing to repeat you'll see but first things first our order is here and let's collect it we're gonna get a CS3 a armor which is not something we want but yeah let's go because if you refuse then he's gonna charge you more for the next order you make Now we know that armor suit is not something we want because it's crap, but you know, it is what it is. That's, if you remember from the clear sky, that's the clear sky armor. It is better than ours, but look at the weight. It's 11 kilos in comparison to one and a half, which is really bad. Do bear in mind that this one has its weight reduced by three and a half kilos, so original weight was five. This one has one container, and I don't know if our guy can improve it. Let's just have a look with him. If he can add an additional artifact container, that's gonna that's gonna be better. But right now, this suit is not useful to us. Yeah, we can add additional containers, but he needs tools. And I don't know. I really don't know if I want to use it. I might just sell it and then take the L. Because my artifacts do help a lot, especially the energy recovery one. So we're going to get 10k back from it. I know this is a bad move. But I don't see myself finishing the game with this armor. I just don't and don't want to because it's ugly. <laughs> so yeah, let's take the L and let's sell it. And we're gonna sell the helmet because we have the exact same helmet but already upgraded. So yeah, let's sell that. So we lost about twenty-seven and a no twenty-six and a half k on that. It is what it is. We still got a lot of money. So yeah, let's take the L. Now, continuing, the missions we have in this area over here, all missions, we have a stash over there, we want to pick up that stash, and then we want to go and speak to Noah about the compass. So yeah, let's go, it's 11 o'clock, the weather is, you know, a typical Chernobyl weather. We got some Zombros, I mean Mutantos over here, I'm gonna take them out. And let's go. Stamina is not that great. We are heavy. I don't know from what. 35 kilos. Oh, because we don't have our artifacts on. Where is the one that... Yeah, that's the one that we use radiation. Right, that's pretty... That's much better. Okay. Now let's run straight for that artifact over there and let's use an energy drink too. Look at that. I love that stamina. And I did give a test to the new suit and our stamina is suffering. The mobility is just bad. And since we don't have the tools to upgrade and pimp out that suit, I'm just not gonna go for it. it I did try it. I said I played for an hour and it just didn't work just not worth the investment. I don't know, I might just wing it until I get enough money for an exo and I'm 
do I get all of the tools and go with the exoskeleton straight? That's the path. And we're actually hungry and we don't have any food. That's not that bad. Still. We did visit the antenna complex. I don't remember what's in this stash. But you know, we are aiming to complete every single stash that we can find on the map. We are looking to find every single secret in the game. Because that's why we are here. That's the only way to get immersed into the zone. So this one is pretty easy if you know how to do it. Basically you shoot them down. And that's your stash. Did we get everything? I think we did. No, we didn't. Put some green stuff. There we go. Alright, now the next mission is Noah. We just follow the arrow on the map and we're going to Noah. Well, I don't know about you, but this rain is making everything more scary it's just uh, I wish it could be sunny all the time in the zone oh by the way the new detector we found I don't know if you saw this but the new detector is actually going to show us anomalies too so that's going to be really useful and the handgun we have the Desert Eagle one really goes in. I managed to one-shot a mutant. I don't know if there was a headshot or something, but still, that's really impressive. I have a lot of stopping power. Another thing I figured out is we can do this. We can actually carry two weapons with us. Doesn't make a lot of sense, but still it makes your inventory look a lot better. Doesn't reduce the weight. Doesn't do anything for you, but you don't have a handgun while you have your detector out. So I don't know how useful that is, but it's a nice thing to include in the game. This is the first installment that could do this. Other installments were a handgun and an assault rifle and that's it. Alright, let's go to Noah from the other side he's gonna do his thing as soon as we open the door Go to hell, does that look like a mutant? hello Noah but we are here to talk to him about the compass I need a compass artifact do you know where I might find it and look at this boom we received a compass clear off Thank you, Noah. Now, if we look at the compass, it's one of the end game items. So, energy recovery, electrical, star protection, moving. chemical, and thermal protection. And at a cost of low radiation. Hey, bro. So, we have a decision to make. Do we want to give Beard a compass? Or to tell him to piss off? And I don't know if I'm going to be able to find another compass in this game, in this walkthrough. They are really, really rare. Without using any guides, I really don't know if we're going to find it. So, I made a con conscious decision not to give him the compass. I'm going to be a greedy bastard and keep the compass for myself. I shouldn't be running around this zone with a bolt in my hand, should I? I think I, I will sleep a little bit because the rain is creeping me out. It's just like a sensory overload. It's not pleasant to play. Alright, beard. Hello! I I refuse to look for a compass for you. Mission complete. 
but I am going to buy some food. Oh, look at that. He has artifacts with him now. That could be useful. But what do you have? Stone flower, not interested. This could be interesting. Mama's beads, wound healing. Soul. Crystal. Night star. Maximum weight, plus four kilos. That's not really good. Jellyfish. Just radiation removal. And a sparkler. Cool. Now out of these, this could be good. That's the only artifact I want. But I do remember that we have a mission requiring us to bring some artifacts. Meat chunk. Uh, yeah, we don't have a meat chunk with him. Now I am considering to buy this one, but the thing is we cannot install an additional container right now, so I'm not. I'm gonna keep keep my money for now. And then I'll see. Pop in if you that. find any artifacts and we'll see what we can do. Now why are we getting radiation again? Minus three, plus three, should be zero, should be cancelling itself out. Okay, so... Hey, stalker, how are you? We are going back to Piano Station. Howdy ho! And then we are going to figure out what to do. If you want to enter, holster your weapon. I'm listening, man. I'm always checking the uh, traders because no. you never know if he's gonna have a set of suit on him. It would be nice if he did. I'm gonna sell the crappy bullets because these are better. Armor piercing, yeah. He doesn't have any special ammo, so that's pretty much it. Now, I'm gonna I'll leave my time. artifacts again. Don't need to carry them around. I do have the most important ones on me. I'm gonna leave the compass for now, and we are gonna use it as soon as we get another container on our suit. Now, let's go to the doctor. Well, spill it! Sell all of our Wonder again. drugs. I'm gonna keep the anti out drugs forever now. They come in handy in a sticky situation. Stay out of trouble. Okay, what's our weight? 31. Happy with that. I'm listening, man. Alright, it's time to make a plan. So we got this entire area. This is something we cannot do right away because we don't have the access to it. So we are going to complete this entire area in this part. This is the hostage we need to free. This is... Yeah, the suit, the bandits that, that were taking more money from the guy and then increasing the taxes and the interest every single time. So basically we're gonna kill all the bandits here and here. And then we are gonna investigate the Stingray site. And we have the ventilation complex. Now, the ventilation complex cannot be accessed from here. It can be accessed from here. And that's something I discovered in the hour and something I lost that recording but basically I was trying to free this guy and a mission hit so I dropped all my stuff and ran because the map was showing that this is a safe area basically you go through the uh, zombies are gonna be here they're gonna try to kill you you take out the zombies you take out the mutants you go through the ventilation shafts or something like that it's like an underground maze and you end up here and this is the true maze and if you complete the maze 
you get a banging artifact, but it's gonna be really hard to repeat because I don't know how I completed the maze. It was just running around for 10 minutes and I did it. Okay, so bear with me. So first things first, we're gonna grab that stash. But since it's five, nearly half past five, the night is gonna be soon. So I'm just gonna go and have a nap. And do I remember where to go? Yeah, downstairs. And we're gonna do that first thing in the morning. And hopefully we won't have the rain. No, we still it's still raining outside, is it? And we are very hungry. That's an annoying thing about this game. We are always hungry. Okay. Now we are ready to continue. Oh, we have a stash over there too. To be fair, I think we explored everything there. Might as well just... Might as well... Yeah, let's make a quick detour. The, the day is young. And we have enough time. We have a special detector, so I wonder if this special detector is going to show me something over there. Because I remember... Peace out, man! Hold that cannon of yours. Why are you shooting at me? What's wrong with you? We require immediate assistance. We won't hold out for more than three. Yep. Yeah. There's definitely something here. Now let's see. We have our special detector. Let's take this detector. Oh, here we go. Can we check in anything? Oh. Oops. Uh, I don't think we made it in time, guys. Okay, so now we know. Whichever way we go, we always end up at the same exact spot. I still can't get used to this fog. It's weird. The Chaburni disappeared without a trace. Maybe he found a way out? Day six. We have run out of water. The colonel flipped his lid and shot two people at point blank range and then himself. Now I'm on my own in this damn anomaly. If I hadn't fixed for our communications with HQ to the dam, they would have rescued us. And you, they wouldn't have existed. I wonder how things would have turned out. Ah, screw it. That Captain Tachenko died a long time ago. And this General Tachenko of duty will follow him. That's justice, I suppose. Okay, so now we know what happened. I wonder if we had that detector in time, would we, would we be able to save them? Okay, somebody do, does see us. Uh, hopefully... That somebody's not a bloodsucker. Okay, that's the stash. What's wrong with these TSRs? Every single time I find a stash with a TSR in it, I can't pick it up. And again, nothing special about it. So yeah, just a waste of time, but we did pick up that stash. Okay, and we did sort that situation out. So we're going for the stash, and then we're going to deal with the banditos. I really wonder. That would be a nice way to kick off the part by saving like five duty guys, but 
the guy that say in PDA that he's gonna like they killed each other and they are lost <laughs> um, yeah I don't know I will look it up later off stream if, if it's possible to to free those guys and 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 have a happy ending for them because right now we chucked the bolt inside and we killed five of them that's how it looked to me and I wonder, can you free them without the detector? Somehow, maybe chatting with the scientists, but we did that, we did ch try to chat with them. But yeah, they said no because we didn't have the suit, so maybe because of that, who knows. Okay, that's the stash. What did we pick up? Again, nothing special, just an AK and a lot of bullets for our TSR. I'll keep that PDA. Now, we are going over there. To deal with El Banditos. So there's going to be like 15 of them in that base and we need to take the payment to them. You probably have a, have an idea what kind of payment they will get for me from me. Now, as it stands, me and Beninitos are neutral, but I'm gonna change that right now. Now we, we just need to find a good vantage point, and I figured this is the best one. From here, I can shoot through the windows. There's only one way in, and that's how we are gonna kick this. One off. The best way to start it off is by knifing him to the face and let's have fun. Hello, Chikibriki. Oh, that actually connected. Some, some ninja sniping here. I'm so glad I have my Vintar because we are still playing on the, the veteran but we are one-shotting everything and we just have to be careful not to let him come upstairs to us because that's where we die leave that bomb he wanted to throw that grenade so loud there we go. Hello, Chicky Briggy. Six of them left. No grenades. No, 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 no. Oh, he did chop one. Their aim is pretty good. That was sarcastic. Ironic. Alright, got, got him. Four of them left. I can't see them though. No, oh no, no, no. How did I end up here? Crap. Well, that was unfortunate. Okay. Let's repeat that. Oh no. They are grenading me. Well. That was such a bad aim. On the roof. I missed. Stop moving. And I noticed that our Vintar is just savage and we still have few upgrades to do on it. So I wonder how good it will get. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing in here? We are about to die, are we? Yep. Yeah. It's not going good. It's not smooth. I need to be faster not to let him come upstairs with me. Alright, got him.
Cheeky breaky. It seemed like that, that one went through the window. That was bad shooting. Really? I need to end this quickly because their aim is getting better, much better. Yeah, I'm not focusing on headshots right now because I don't want them to, to clown upstairs with me again. That was scary. Got him. See them. Alright, there's one of them injured somewhere. Two of them left. Let's quick say we don't want to repeat that again. Okay, that's the one. I think that's the one with the, the nasty shotgun. One left. I swear that's the guy that's gonna take us out. Oh, that's the guy with the nasty shotgun. That grenade from you and the energy drink. Where's the nasty shotgun? You had it and you dropped it. Really? Oh, we, we picked it up. Look at that. Eliminator. Really good piece of kit. I wonder if we upgrade it, how good it's gonna be. It's probably the best shotgun in the game. I'll just pick up the bandages. And what about you? Grenades, food, drugs, bandages, grenades. How did you end up here? Bandits love their grenades, apparently. Why did I pick that up? I'm paying attention. Okay. I'm just looking for artifacts mainly, that's why I'm looting every single one of them. Artifacts, food, Hercules is always nice. It's the drink that increases our weight that we can carry for a little while. That's really good if we need to get somewhere fast, like to we'll survive an admission and we are not close to any cover. Medkits are always nice. Shotgun ammo, since we have a shotgun now. Yeah, we killed two guys over here. PSR, nothing special about it. Some grenades. That's it. Yeah. So the payment has been made. And we need to get rid of something. About what? We are called Abby. Let's eat some food. Let's drop the crappy grenades. Let's eat some more food and some more. And we are under 50. And now our stamina is good. Okay. Oh, we're going the wrong way. We explored this area. And we're going to explore the ventilation complex as soon as we kill the banditos over there. So that's our next mission. And then we are going to wrap it up.
with the exploration of the ventilation complex now hopefully that's not gonna take an hour to do but I'm really anxious about it oh that guy is done for where there's got him just use an energy train let's drop these uh, that's so annoying me picking up items that I I don't want to pick up and I actually explored everything here there is no way to get into the ventilation complex from here and if you look down this is the maze that we will pass soon and I have an idea so the guys at work trapped in that bubble. I think they were trying to solve that maze, that ventilation complex maze, but they failed. And just the only thing that doesn't back up the, the theory is them being on a different spot, which was on the other side of the map. Because even when you solve the maze, you end up here and you can exit the same way you entered but once you go inside the maze you have to solve it there's no way around it okay we are ready let's quick save and let's open it up shouldn't be sitting on the floor, it's bad for your kidneys. That was... Um, he has a good throw. Reloading in broad daylight. Are you mad? <laughs> that was an amazing headshot. You have to find a better cover, buddy. So, our... Our friend is still alive and good. I'll just take the food and the rat drugs. Up in here. Just put this back. They're trying to kill him. They're going in. I just don't want to get him and oh my goodness, he was faster. Okay, let's try that again. I don't know if my suit is slowing me down, but I I am dying more than usual. They don't have, like, endgame weapons, but yeah, if I had a better suit, it would be much easier, definitely. Hey. He was so lost there, okay. That's the guy that took us out. And he nearly did it again. Let's just take anti rad trucks. Yeah, check your breakage, you can break your back and shoot. Where is he shooting? Um, uh huh. Not today. There should be more of them inside, yeah?
We got blasted. Point blank shot to the face. Alright, time to change the tactic a little bit. Did you just kill your friend without the hate? That's the shot camera. This weapon goes in. Alright, four of them left. Our buddy is still alive. At this point, if I was El Banditos, I would just oh, I would just grab him and use him as a human shield. So there is a bad man at your door, and at this point, if he took out ten of you guys, your chances of surviving are slim to nothing. One over there, we can actually flank him. Good. There's one of them left, and our boy is still alive. I don't know what happened with the sound. One more step, and he's dead. That's my last step. And he's Thanks still for alive. saving me. Man, I thought this was gonna. Be the end of me. Wow, you took all of these bandits on your own. You're the man. They won't believe me when I tell the story. Can we get out of here now? Yes. Let's get out of here right now. I can loot while I'm running. Attention! Attention! An emission is approaching. Find the cover immediately. Okay, so we're gonna go and find cover. This is exactly what happened last time. But it was much worse than this is. We might just die here because we are very heavy. Okay, let's drop all of the crabs that we're carrying and let's run. Run for it. Alright, a mission is gonna hit. And this is where I ran the last time. I might die now. So bear with me. Yeah, this is like a high pressure situation. We are gonna make it, trust me. We made it the first time with just a bent bar and no armor. safe here. I can't even remember the way I went last time around. I remember panicking and just running like a madman. But I guess we are safe here because we are not taking any damage. 
let's wait for the emission to pass and then we are gonna explore this complex hopefully we can do the maze quickly took me about 10 minutes last time around attention attention an emission is about to hit find cover immediately we are in cover Emissions are scary, dude. I don't know why we are losing like vision here and why is the screen like this because we are in pure cover. And I did notice that there are drugs that help you survive an emission, but I don't know how effective they are. Like, this is pretty scary. Moving around. The emission is over. I hope everyone's okay. Really? If you're hurt, come to Yanov and we'll patch you up. Where did that come from? Just a random bird. Okay. Let's go. Let's go save. Oh, it's it's off. They do so much damage. Right, this is where we want to go. Up here. Imagine me panicking running from an emission with no armor, no medkit, low on time, and ending up in here. Imagine that. Alright. Like a maze, a proper maze. And here we are. This is where we need to go. And this is the oasis. Now, first time around, this is actually a labyrinth, a puzzle. First time around, I really don't remember how I did it. I was just running randomly around and I figured it out. But I don't remember how. Now, I think those trees have to do something with it. So I'm just going to follow the trees. Because at the point I started following the trees, I started to unlock the secrets. So I'm going to do it this time around and hopefully that's going to help. And every single time, it's going to just take you to the beginning of it. It's going to rotate you. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. So trees, follow the trees, and this will appear. Now let's do it again. Hopefully that's the key to solving the, the secret of the oasis. Did, did more of them appear? Seems like it, yeah. Let's go again. And you will know when you complete it because the mission will update. Doesn't seem like anything changed this time around. Let's just quickly use an energy drink. Okay, nothing's changing. So this time around. Since this one is one before the end, let's go through one before the end, and then let's just pick out the middle one. Oh, that's a weird one. Middle, I guess, and then this side around, and let's see if that's going to change anything. No, it didn't change anything. Let's try going through them. Maybe that's gonna change something. As I said, I really don't know what's the key of solving this one. I'm just running around like a madman. Let's 
Let's try going through here. Maybe simplicity is the key. Doesn't seem like it. Just random stuff. Oh, maybe if we turn back. Let's see what's gonna happen. Oh, maybe we can exit out of it. Which we don't want to do. Oh, one more spawned over there. Hey. Let's do it now. So left. Let's go to middle. Let's go here. Let's go here. Maybe that's gonna help. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing uh, the answer. Maybe going through them since one more appeared. Oh, yeah, yeah. We have one of them every single time. Can we pass? Oh, yeah, we solved it. So again, I don't know how we solved it. We were doing random sh stuff. We followed the trees and I know that the trees, if you follow them, you will spawn one. But after that, it was just random stuff. And actually, I did it quicker than the first time around. And basically, this is the secret of the oasis that I stumbled upon by running from the anomaly. And yeah, uh, running from the mission. So yeah, we got the secret of the oasis. And the quest is actually over here. Oasis. Wazerski, the science scientist from the bunker, asked you to try to find the oasis, a legendary place in the zone. According to rumors, there should be some healing waters there. Healing water, water there, waters. Ah, uh, whatever. But nobody really knows whether it exists or not. Now we know. Now let's quick save because I know for a fact. As soon as I steal this beautiful artifact, we are gonna get swarmed. There we go. By a beautiful pseudo dog. And now we want to exit. It would be nice if we could go through there. But let me show you what kind of artifact we managed to get. So plus two healing restoration, hunger elimination, energy recovery, wound healing, and plus four radiation. So in combination with our compass, that's going to be a good all-around combo. And then we probably want one more artifact. That's going to give us more endurance. And I think we are good. Let's be on our way. Let's get out of here. Now I'm glad everything's clear. So we don't have to worry about that. Let's quick save. One more time? I think yeah, one more time. As I said, this entire place is a maze. Am I lost again? I think I am. Over here, yeah. Let's loot the Zombros. Have some food, I'll gladly take that. Some, oh, a Hercules. Might as well. Let's food again. And we picked up this weapon, did we? Don't need it. Cool. And some med kits, I'll take that. And another Hercules. Dombros love their Hercules potions. Okay. Let's get out of here.
so that's completed so we can say did we complete this area over here yeah yeah that's where the the banditos were we completed this area this area is done we completed the checkpoint so this is the last area over there so we're going to the helipads let's explore that I might as well pick up Vintar now and it's raining again beautiful well at least we don't have the th thunderstorm Mines. That's nice of you. At least you translated it for us. To be fair, I can read this too. Okay, so mines. Let's quick save. And the best way. I was hoping the artifact detector is gonna show me something. That's a mine, definitely. Just by the sound it's creating. And that's a mine too. That's a mine too. That's a mine too. Alright, let's go through here. Oh, there, there's somebody over there. Can we navigate? Mind, mine. I think one of these mines is gonna kill us if we step on it. Oh crap! That scared the hell out of me. I went there because the bolt did not create the sound. Oh, good. The weather is better. And now it's gonna rain. No, it's not good. Alright, let's try that again. I really want to go and, and loot that guy over there. Okay. Interesting. Is it even smart? Is it worth it to go and loot that guy over there? Can we shoot at the grenades? Probably don't use my Ventar for it. Yeah, that should set off a, a bomb. If there is a bomb there, that should set it off. Not okay, it is what it is. That's a grenade. Mine, I think. So don't go there. This should be safe. No, it's not safe. Okay, fine. Now I'm determined to get to that guy and see... Oh, didn't want to do that. I really want to navigate to the minefield. Okay. How do we do it? There is a guy over there, I think. Okay, this is pretty easy here. This is a rough patch. I can see where they were digging. The thing is. I don't think we have any mines over here, let's quick save. It wouldn't be... Yeah, there is no way they can dig there. Okay, so can we go from here and help out... I mean, loot the guy, not help him out. This is the plan. 
Doesn't seem like there is a grenade there, but let's now risk it. Hello, buddy. So not worth it. Military. So that's one of our boys. So now you know. Alright. First of all, let's loot. Actually, is that even smart? With all the grenade being around. Let's salute from far. And not enter the house. There isn't anything there. I don't think there is anything in this area. Maybe in the truck. That's a mine probably. Nothing. Alright. Every time I activate a quick time event, I'm worried that the mutants are gonna pop out. I think this is a good, good place to test our new shotgun. Hopefully, two bodies. We are protected by the Looks mines. Looks like they died in the crash. It. Everything of value has been looted, and the onboard computer has been wiped clean, but the black box is still intact. Interesting. I reckon a decent technician will be able to extract the information on it and decode it. Yep, yeah, cool. Why me? That was actually fun. Seeing those mutantos die like that. You ugly mug. Okay, so that's sorted. Now we have an option. Should we go over there? We should. Let's just go again. Yeah, let's keep going. Let's keep exploring. But first quick save because we're gonna about we're gonna go through the minefield and we don't wanna die. Yep, we're golden. Alright. I'm just Ooh, how heavy are you? Three kilos, black box. You don't look like a black box, do you? I was expecting a box that's black. But this is not a box. It's fine. Okay. I'm just checking. Yeah, just straightforward, even though I think... It's actually a bandit. Have you seen that bullet ricochet? Yeah, oh, that's such a nice effect. What a headshot. I love the fact that they did that. He was standing still and I missed him, but now when he's moving I managed to get a clear headshot. I'm detecting three of them on the map. I wonder where they are. Aha, uh -huh, there they are. Okay. Still one of them left somewhere. Bandit, 
Bandit Tactics 101. This is how they took me out when I started playing with the Stalker games. They would flank me all day, every day, and just... Yeah, and me. Ooh! I'll take that, thank you. And this. And a special shotgun ammo. I still don't know how I feel about the new shotgun. It looks good, I'll give you that. And it has a badass name. I can hear some mutants. Because I don't feel safe over here. I'm too heavy. That was stressful. Alright, there was one of them on the bridge too. Take a while to explore. You know what? I think I, I'm just gonna make a short break over here because I don't want the videos to be too long. I'll take out these mutants and just cut the video and continue recording. I don't know how long we are in the recording of this part. It feels like we are close to an hour. Yep, got him. Alright. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next part. If you did have fun on this one, check the subscribe my way. It means a lot. Thank you guys.